purposely makes my job harder. Okay, go run. The syringe just disappears. And shit. Anyway, this is based off um, an anime-ish cartoon. It looks exactly the same as this, really. The graphics look just like the show, which is quite good, really. It helps to create the... Like you're actually playing out an episode. James, he's so annoying, he follows you around. Hmm, what a day. You can spy on people like right little kid throwing this everywhere. There's Catherine. Next time I'll really give him a piece of my mind. Yeah. I don't even know what Gregory said then. When he makes that noise, a ping, that means he's hinted towards something. Uh, basically Catherine can't see in front of her. So I put a banana peel on the floor, she will drop her soul. And James, you know why you love, um, bring out banana peels? Well, I'm gonna play in on your little game and, yeah. Switch between key items if I want. And the thing is, I don't think Gregory's aware that you're trying to get all the souls yet. And then, you, you can just pick up souls right in front of him, you won't even notice. Where is she? Oh, yeah. Where'd he go? Oh, I don't even know where he is. Mm. Go away, James. Oh, I didn't mean to drop my banana peel. Hello, Catherine. Yeah, they're getting suspicious huh? of me. Oh, so close. I, I still mean, where's Gregory? There he is. He gives you a map. Um, in total, there are five floors to this. <laughs> One upstairs and three basements. Yes, this is so helpful. Wait, where is she? I think she's coming back now. No. Is she coming? She is. That's a bit far away, but oh well. Not a problem. If you notice what she said just before she fell, then I'm such an idiot. I can't see in front of me. Whoa! <laughs> okay, so we've already got a soul. Ha 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 ha! I'm gonna get a soul. The weird thing is, you can walk right through her, which is really weird. You can. Oh, I thought you could knock on her, but you can't. I've just seen Nico zombie. Neko zombie, I don't know. Good job. Yeah. But Catherine's on the warpath. Oh. If she gets you, it'll be needle time. Yeah, so she wants her soul back, so she's gonna chase you and kill you. Well, she'll take out a lot of your health. But at the moment, you don't have health. You haven't been given, like, a HP meter. It's like gone! This. It's gone! My soul, it's gone! And, um... I one time when I was that watching this cut scene, taken it. the syringe now wasn't I'm there. Really angry. Yeah, it was a glitch, and the syringe wasn't there. And it's weird. You, you, if she catches you, like there'll be like a Final Fantasy transition, and you'll like be on a stage, like, and she'll perform her. What can you do about? I don't know. Punishment on you. No one around here. The power of your beliefs is everything. There it is, mental gauge. It always goes down. You've got to keep it up by reading books, eating herbs. Yeah, it's a Capcom game. Go figure. And... Go to sleep. Yeah, yeah, I've, I've just explained all this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've always wanted a sequel to this game, but... Alright. Do you know Judgment Boy? Oh, God. Do you know my name? It's not judgment wrong! 
I never noticed that! Wait, that is wrong, isn't it? Judgment Boy came to the isn't... hotel to pass final judgment on troubled hearts. Isn't that... You did uh... a good job today. Now, go back to your room and get some rest. I'm sure that's I'm not... not a... I am positive that that's not how you spell judgment. Ow. Oh. to sleep again. My room will be more useful to me later in the game, like the desk and the cupboard and the table. Come They'll all like, have some use for me. Give it up. Probably. Throw away all them worries. <sighs> oh, it's you. Oh. Did you manage to pick up any souls? I did. I will be asleep if I had not So, you only brought me one. I did. Shall I take it? No, don't take it. No, you'll get out of here if I don't give it to you. So no, don't take it. Whatever you do. Hey, thanks a lot. Here, I will stamp your card for you. Okay. Good luck, there, buddy. Yeah. That's two down. Ten to go. And then what? In part two now? Yeah, we're in part two. Not bad. Well then. I'd better start getting ready to receive the new guest. Uh-huh. <laughs> that was hilarious. Okay, so now all the rooms on the ground floor will be open, so I can go to the library, the jacuzzi. The new doors that are still locked are doors that will be occupied by guests later on in the game. Their nameplate is already next to the door, like they know they're going to be in there. Now I have a schedule, so um, I can write down what people are doing when I spy on them. Judgment! Do you know my name? Judgment! What? What? Hey, you're that new guest, aren't you? A twat, wasn't mm. it? Now that I look at you more closely, I see you've got an awful lot on your mind. I do. If you ever want my help, just bring a symbol of your problem. I will. Then I'll give you one of my special judgments. Oh, boy. Judgment! Oh, Jesus. Gotta love him. And Catherine. Oh, she's in the nurse's office. And eventually, you will find a book on self help in the library. It's only there for some parts in the day. And I need that. Can pick up some books. The book that I knit. Get out the bloody white purple eyed man, mouse. The book that I need will appear there, but I'm leaning over like that one is right there. So many books that are here that I can have. Syringe monthly. Gotta love syringe monthly, Gregory Exposed. Ooh, I just got two editions of it in one go. That's amazing. Guide to poison. I really want my guide to poison. And yeah, the map is helpful so you can check on if there's anyone there that's going to get you and kill you and... Oh, I don't know. And something else that will be useful is this. A dirty book found in Catherine's room. If Catherine was on the way by now, I'm sorry. And a hidden trading card. Oh, okay. Not what I expect. Oh, well, never mind. I'm, I'm getting mixed up. Oh, yeah, it's only bandages. I don't need that, do I? Okay. I'm gonna go in my room where James can't get me, thank God. He's so annoying. Now I can put my books in the bookcase.
Um, I'm gonna read a book. Syringe. How my syringe changed my life. Ooh, I felt all tingly. Ooh. Slightly strange. A twat's mental gauge has got bigger. I wonder who this mental gauge is. is. Catherine's down in the dining room. Gregory's in there. I'm gonna check, see if it's there. No, I actually have no idea when the book is there. I got stuck on this when I was a kid for about two years. Obviously, I didn't play it all the time. I stopped playing it because I got stuck. But I spent two years not knowing what to do, so... I love looking it up on the internet. What's this? What's all that commotion in the hall? Nothing, there's no one there. Some kind of strange song. Do you know my name? Judgment! <laughs> <laughs> you know Gregory. I mean, I don't know why I said you know Gregory. In the anime, the song's different. Is Judgment Boy? I saw Judgment Boy's lights. I probably did. <gasps> Catherine's coming out of the kitchen. Let's see if the book's there now. I don't know, it might be. I have no idea. I think... No, it's not there. It might be there at like 6pm. I'm not entirely sure at all. I think Catherine's coming up. Oh no, she's going the opposite way. <laughs> Let's spy on Judgment Boy. Do you know my name? Judgment! You know, in the, yeah, as I was trying to say, and you know, in the anime, the song that um, Judgment Boy sings is different. In the anime, it's, do you know who I Oh, sh Catherine was in the lounge. Do you know who I am? They call me Judgment Boy. But in the game, it's, do you know my name? Judgment! Which doesn't really make as much sense, but, oh well. There's Catherine eating donuts. <laughs> really though, that a twat. Yeah, um, that's what love horse at the door means. They're doing something that they like doing, and no, it doesn't mean that love horse huh? at the door. It might usually mean that, but it doesn't in this case. Is she like saying that I'm? <laughs> Who cares? I need to worry about it. It's drawing blood. He he he. That's just weird. And as risky as this is, I'm going in her nurse's room for a second. Hello, James. I'm gonna get the Hell Chef card. Which, he's a character later on in the game. He's a chef that is a candle as well, which is quite cool, really. It. it I don't know why, but it seems to make sense for me. That maybe it's because I've just grew up, like, with the thought a chef candle. I'm gonna creep Catherine out. What could this be? What could this be? She's gonna think it was Gregory. Well then. Yeah, she can't see it from that far away. You can see father dad when you're, you know, doing the thingy. But yeah, when you're doing first person mode, you walk slow as well. You can sneak behind people. And this room right here is where you can save your game. There's a guy in there, he's a frog, a fortune teller frog. He doesn't, he can't come out the room. He appears in a cut. He's relevant to the story at some point. Spoiler. <sighs> he's got glasses on. Um, oh, I don't know when that book's supposed to show up, I know it, you know. Ah. The library is a good place to um, run away from people when they're chasing you. Because you can just run around that aisle and go back out the door. Well, Looks then. like everything's okay today. Ooh, but that James. Mm, what in the world what? was he doing in Catherine's room? Yeah, I've got to give him... Oh, is it? Do I have to give him the dirty book? Uh, how nice to see you. Oh, oh, where did you... Find that book. <laughs> you don't say. You found it in Catherine's room. <laughs> Hand it over. Look, look, he was freaking out. He just stops when this comes up. It would be wise not to make too much of a fuss. And then he runs to a, a storeroom You're and reads it. It's his dirty book. I'm sure a little. I'll show it to you later on. Now